today we're going to be going over the smallest helmet that you can have on the road this one right here it is a beauty i got my little smiley face sticker on there and i got my two brother race and exhaust sticker right there i might end up putting more What up? Welcome back to another video guys. Today I have something a little different, short little video just to knock it out the way. So many, so many people ask me all the time, where do I get this little tiny helmet here? This is the smallest helmet that you'll probably find on the road. Um, and I'm gonna tell you exactly where to get it. I'm also gonna be going over the vest that I got for the same exact place uh, about two, three days ago. Um, but let's first hop into the, um, the helmet. As you can see right here, very small, very minimal. Um, it's like the smallest hat shell helmet you can find out there. I'll put it on for you right now as well. Um, if it helps in any way, um, when it comes to fitted hats, um, fitted uh, baseball caps, I am a size seven. So if you're around that size, you already know what this is gonna look like on you. So this is what it looks like. So in my opinion, it does look really good. You guys can be the judge of that. I'll show you what it looked like with some shades on. Um, so it fits really comfortable when you put it on with shades. It doesn't bother me in any way. Um, the helmet itself is pretty uh, comfortable. Um, it's very, very, very light. Let me just go ahead and throw on this vest just because. So really good. Uh, this is actually a size small, guys. So if you're wondering as well. I mean, I'm 5'7", so this is what the the vest looks like real real nice material the material is really good nice leather quality really nice the place where i got all this from it used to be called biker hill um it is called something else now it's now called biker access and um i was talking to the owner the last time i went to pick up the vest uh, a few days ago and he told me that he's actually going to be moving from that spot he's going to be located to a different location now and he's going to be mostly doing most of his sales online so if you guys want to go ahead and access that, the website at the moment is down, so you can um, go ahead on this Amazon link. I'm gonna link up the, the Amazon link down in the description box so if you guys want to go shop for this helmet, shop for a vest, shop for anything biker uh, related when it comes to gear like that. He carries a bunch of stuff, real cool dude, amazing. I went in there just to get the, get the vest and I was in there literally in there talking to him for like 45 minutes or so. So this is a look at what the inside of the uh, helmet looks like. Um, if you're wondering if it's a uh, DOT, it's not, um, but I mean, you can get the sticker for it. Um, and then he also gave me this nice little cool sticker, which I, I like right here, it looks pretty cool. Um, but no, it is not DOT approved. Um, it is the smallest helmet. Once that sticker's on there, I mean, nobody's really gonna pull you over, honestly, so you could do whatever you want i mean as long as you put the sticker on it you're gonna get away with it you know no one's gonna really go up to you and inspect your helmet is dot approved or not um but pretty cool um i believe these do come in a matte black if not if anything they do have bigger ones so if you don't want this one they have little bigger ones but most of the time obviously people hate those half shell helmets because it makes your head look like a mushroom i'm gonna show you guys another one that i have now which is the um german style helmet this one here, obviously way bigger, um, as you can see. So it does make my head look like a mushroom, kind of. Um, I bought this helmet and I wore it probably about five times, if anything. Um, so it's like basically brand new. I don't, I don't, I don't use it anymore. Just, I don't know, I'm like, I'm not crazy about it. Um, it is DLT approved. Uh, I got this one from Cycle Gear. All right, now back to the uh, vest. This is what the vest looks like inside. Very nice. Uh, the inside pockets right here on both sides are both really really deep so you could you can stash anything in there like anything Let's not go over what you could stash in there, but I mean you could hook things onto this right here if you want and they're really big so you can literally shove anything you want in there if you want to get food or other stuff this one obviously has a no collar. They do have some that have the collars. They have, they have all different type of leathers. I just, I really like this one a lot. I really wanted a medium. They didn't have medium. So I was like, you know what? Let me just take the small. Um, I can still, still fit a hoodie under there, if anything, for later on in the fall time. So that's that. All right, guys, that's gonna be it. So if you wanna shop for any of these items, go hit that Amazon link down below. And um, I'm gonna catch you in the next one. 
Like always, guys, let the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.